These are the results from our transformation experiment. The procedure used Escher E. coli, which is commonly called E. coli, which is not competent. So what we did is put calcium chloride salts in with the E. coli, which opened up the pores in its cell walls, which allow the plasma to enter. And the reason we put it on ice was to supercoil the DNA and make it smaller. And then we heat shocked it for 90 seconds because 90 seconds gave enough time for the PBLU plasmid to enter the E. coli and incorporate into E. coli's DNA to make it competent, which makes it ampicillin resistant. And then we used the X Exgal, that gave it the blue color as you can see here. And we put PBLU plasmids into E. coli to make it competent so that way it could become ampicillin resistant. And the blue is a marker which shows us that it was successful.